The Bonan language pronounced Piao-na, Baoning, Chinese Baoanyu Baoanyu, Amdu Tibetan Dorke is the Mongolic language of the Bonan people of China. As of 1985, it was spoken by about 8,000 people, including about 75% of the total Bonan ethnic population and many ethnic Mongar, in Gansu and Qinghai provinces and the Ningxia Wei Autonomous Prefecture. There are several dialects, which are influenced to varying degrees, but always heavily, by Tibetan and Chinese, while bilingualism in Wudan is less common. The most commonly studied is the Tongren dialect. There is no writing system in use. The language is also referred to as Managacha, natively. Phonology Bonin phonology has been heavily influenced by Tibetan. Consonants possess a plus or minus aspirated contrast. Initial consonant clusters of mostly falling sonority are present in native words, as are heavy diphthongs, though the content of both is heavily restricted. The possible word initial consonant clusters in Bonin are MP, NT, NT, K, T, Kai, Kai, T, RT, LT, Feet, FK, P, K. Nyantok Bowen has six vowels, A, E, I, U, with long counterparts for all except Morphology Bonin, like other Mongolic languages, is agglutinative. There are five case markings for Bonin nouns, nominative, accusative genitive, dative locative, ablative comparative, and instrumentative. Verbal morphology is quite complex. Evidentiality is marked in the indicative mood as definite, or indefinite, with a specific suffix or with an auxiliary verb. The present definite is used to mark naturally occurring phenomena, while the present indefinite indicates the habits of animals. The indefinite may also mark volition. The future, continuous, and perfective suffixes also possess markers for evidentiality that are often used to mark negation. Syntax Bonin has a primary SOV, subject-object verb, but topicalization of an object is common. It is known for its peculiar double marking of the copula. A Mongolic copula, of which there are several with different meanings, comes sentence finally, following Bonin SOV word order, while a copula, from Chinese, to be, appears between the copula's subject and complement, as in Chinese SVO word order. This Chinese copula is optional and is used to emphasize the subject. The definite, but not indefinite, copula can also act as a participle following some finite verbs. For example, end, ku n t, it o, this cop commune gen car eind, cop, this is the commune's car, bu and lu 1985-65, uniquely among Mongolic languages, adjectives follow the noun they modify. This is due to Tibetan influence. References Eugeodin Chulu, Chao Lu Wu, November 1994. Introduction, Grammar, and Sample Sentences for Bowen, PDF. Sino-Platonic Papers. Department of East Asian Languages and Civilizations, University of Pennsylvania, Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, 19104-6305 USA. Bu and Lu Jiaoshang, eds. 1982. Baoanu Janzi. Beijing, Renmin Chubansha. Chen Naishang, ed. 1985. Baoanu Siwi. Mengu Yuzu Yuyan Fangin Yanjiu Sishu 011. Huaheo T. Nimangu Chubansha, ed. 1986. Baoanu Waya Kaliao. MYYFYC 012. Huaheo T. Nimangu Chubansha. Chen Naishang and Singeltai. 1986. Baoanu He Menguyu. MYYFYC 010. Huaheo T. Nimangu Chubansha.